Hello friends, this is Dr. Francis Miles, the best-selling author of the book Issuing Divine Restraining Orders from the Courts of Heaven. Listen, I'm making this prayer available absolutely for free because of the high demand of people who have been saying, can Dr. Miles lead us into the Court of Heaven to get the restraining orders that he is talking about? Well, it's happening. We are doing it right now. You can bring your family members here anytime for this particular restraining order we are about to issue. Right now, we are about to issue a divine restraining order against familiar spirits. What are familiar spirits? Familiar spirits are sometimes called family spirits because they have been in the family for such a long time. So they know your weaknesses. They know your history. They know what, what buttons to push, you know, to get you to react and, or, so that you, in your reaction, you open another door for the devil to get legal rights so he can do other things. So they are very bad and malicious spirits. But I believe that God has an answer for you. It's a divine restraining order from the court of heaven. Before I take you into the court of heaven to issue this restraining order, I just want to give us a biblical basis. Let's just read two scriptures and then I'm going to take you into the court of heaven. Isaiah 19 verse 3 says, The spirit of Egypt will fail in its midst. I will destroy their counsel and they will, con and, and they will consult the idols and the charmers the mediums, and the sorcerers. Then Jesus says in John chapter 8, 8 verse 35 to 36, uh, he says, A slave does not abide in the house forever, but a son abides forever. Therefore, if the son sets you free, you are free indeed. Glory to God. Are you ready to be free from the attack of familiar spirits in your life? Well, let's go into the heavenly courtroom. Simply pray this prayer after me. Heavenly Father, the righteous judge, I come into the court of heaven by the blood of Yeshua the Messiah. Heavenly Father, I'm standing in the heavenly courtroom asking that you would issue a divine restraining order over my life against familiar spirits, against spirits that have been in our bloodline for such a long time. I'm asking God that I will no longer be a victim of those familiar spirits in Yeshua's name. Lord, you said if the Son of Man sets you free, you are free indeed. I'm receiving freedom today from, by the Lord Jesus from these familiar spirits. Heavenly Father, I'm asking that a divine restraining order against familiar spirits be issued. Heavenly Father, I, I ask you to forgive me for anything that I've said or done that would allow this familiar spirit to continue to work against me. And I even ask an appeal to the blood of Yeshua to cleanse my bloodlines of every iniquity, every transgression that, that caused my ancestors to open the door to this familiar spirit to attack me and attack our family. I declare and declare, Father, that from this, day moment, from this moment onwards, you are setting me free from the attack of the familiar spirit. I'm asking God as I'm in the court of heaven that every legal right that Satan has had in the court of heaven against me would be wiped out by the blood of Yeshua, that these familiar spirits who lose any legal right they had to my life, in Jesus, Yeshua's name, I pray. I declare and declare that you are going to assign high-ranking angelic officers of the court of heaven to enforce this divine restraining order, that these familiar spirits will never be able to violate this divine restraining order. Father, I thank you that by faith I receive this divine restraining order against familiar spirits in my life, in Yeshua's name. I thank you for the angelic enforcers from the court of heaven of this divine restraining order. Thank you, Lord, that I am free today of the influence and the power of this familiar spirit, that they are being restrained right now by the power of the Holy Ghost, that the devil will not be able to use these familiar spirits as instruments of death, destruction, delay in my life. I thank you, Lord, for the divine restraining order against the familiar spirits has been granted to me from the court of heaven and sealed by the blood of the Lamb. Thank you, Lord, 
for victory in Yeshua's name, the Messiah, against these familiar spirits. If you have prayed that prayer, my friend, the Lord is going to take care of the rest because he's the judge giving you the restraining order. So guess who is responsible for enforcing the restraining order? The Lord himself. Hallelujah. I'm so happy for you. Shalom, shalom.